Hey guys, it's the Gamer for Life here, and today I'm going to start a new little series of tutorials on Deathly's Mod Editor. Now, I just got the program today, and I am already enjoying it. Um, it's one of the pro it's like the best mod maker ever, especially for me because I don't like I don't program or anything, so I don't know any Java and stuff like that. I know some like the tiniest bit. I wouldn't know any. I really don't know anything. I I could recognize some things, but that's about it. So I really want to make mods, though. However, and I tried the MC Creator and uh, yeah, the MC Creator and stuff. I have that. It's eh, it's all right. Way too many bugs though, and it's the the it's just terrible. Like so many misspells and doesn't even look like they even cared. So I was trying to find another one, and I found this one on um the planet minecraft um, dot com or whatever it is I don't know the full website um, probably all of you guys probably know that um, anyways uh, I had the to the 1.3 point or 1.38 one which is the one point minecraft 1.4.6 one but obviously it doesn't matter because um, the mods work on 1.4.7 also um, and then I made a my own little mod, and it's actually a pretty cool mod, actually. Uh, it's like a Blood Tools mod, and you'll see it in my Let's Play. I'm going to put that in my Let's Play. Like, I'll put my mods that I make in my Let's Play, um, and so you'll see that on one of the, like, one of the later episodes. I will be introducing it, um, and I'll show you a little about it. I'll tell you a little about it. I'm not going to explain it right now. Um... Anyway, so I want to start a little bit of tutorials on it, um, on this program, because I just got the 2.01 pre-release, um, and it's like a really just more modern program. Um, you can it actually it's not just like a jar file. You download you download it, and then it actually has its own little installer and actually installs something into your hard drive. It's not like just a zip file, uh, and it has its own stuff. And I can I've been looking through in it. You can see it has plugins, so there's going to be plugins on eventually. Um, this is a pre-release, so it's not finished. Um, it says that if you find any bugs, to report them. Um, I don't know really anything about the bugs because when I come here, uh, I did give it a diamond. Um, it doesn't look. People are complaining something. Like if I install the mod, uh, there's some little thing. Um, when I press install, it didn't work. It's in an error, but then I moved the folder address and it worked. So if that ever, so I guess if that happens to us, we could just try that. And so yeah, um, let's get started though. So today for the first tutorial, we're just gonna make a simple um, ore. So we're just gonna make our own little ore that's gonna generate. And this is just gonna be the first tutorial, so don't expect much. So the first thing you want to do is, <clears throat> after you install this program, you're going to want to go to new mod, and I'm going to call it YouTube Tutorial Mod. And you can put your own credits and stuff, I'll put the game for life. Um, and you can have your version and stuff, which is actually really neat, so you can have your updated stuff, and now they do have support for advanced coding so if you are do no code or Java and stuff you could do that um, you have your own website link and a logo um, here's where you put the description I'll put YouTube tutorial mod I don't really need to put capitals Oops. Okay. Um, now, what you're gonna want to do is you're gonna want to click on here, the little plus sign, and you're gonna want to click go to block, and then right click on it and click add block. Um, okay, so this is where we're gonna start our block, uh, our little or thing. Um, so here's where you name it. I'm gonna name it YouTube or and you can have the ID 
Um, put 170. Doesn't I don't think it really matters. Um, especially if you use forge, it, sh it should um, change it itself. So now you want to go to material and you want to go down to. You can choose whichever one. I'm gonna since it's an ore, I'm gonna choose iron. And you're gonna want to do stone for the step sound. Um, the hardness. This will be. However, yeah, like how hard it is. I'm gonna put 5.0. And it tells you um, how long it takes to destroy a block. It'll tell you right here. It'll say cobble 3.0 and dirt 0 0.7. So I'll put it a little more than cobble. And resistance is just how um, strong it is against TNT and creepers. Um, <clears throat> I'll put it about 5 also. The light opacity. See it, how much light can go through. Um, I'll put this to 2. And you could make it so it emits light, and I actually kind of want to do that, so I'm gonna do 10. I think that glowstone's 10, so uh, can block grass. Wait, if grass can no, grass cannot grow on this block. Wait, can block? I'm so confused with that. If that, I don't know. If grass can grow on this block, no, don't want. Okay, I think that's what it, that is saying. I think if I uncheck it, it won't. Um, okay, one. Oh, that's pretty cool. Slipperiness. You have how slippery it is. Um, this rendered the block behind this block also fair. In this case, the block is transparent. Okay, we'll just keep that normal, and you could. Edit events. Oh, this is pretty new, actually. So you could do all your different stuff, but for now, we're not going to do any of that. Um, so now this is where we need to do. So we're going to skip this for now. We're going to go to World Generator, and you're going to click Check Mark It, and here's where you have it. So how much it generates. Um, so you could. I'm going to put it. F it's going to generate five ores per chunk and it has 20% chunks and then here's where you set the minimum and max I'm gonna put it so it's always from sea level down so 128 and then is in between 128 and 0 okay so now um, um, here's where uh, you can actually get your texture of it so what I do is I have um, on my thing right here, Pilo M Creator. I in M Creator they have this uh, their own little thing. If you has its uh, in Image Maker right here, um, they have the stone and then they have like ore things. So what I do, I go to edit and I edit it with Paint .dot net. Okay, so here's the stone. Right, so now I go back and go to or and I click copy and I go to edit and paste in a new layer. So now it has this. So this is what I do. Um, if you want me to um, give, if you guys don't know how to get any of the stuff or you just want to make, <clears throat> if you don't want to make your own, you can't for some reason get M Creator to get those files or if you just want me to give them to you, you can just ask me and I'll send you the files to these pictures, these um, PNG files. Um, they are 16 by 16, which mine, oh yeah, that's all you need to know. You have to, they have to be 16 by 16 files. Um, okay, so now I'm going to uncheck background and here's the actual ore, the part on that's going to go on the stone. So we're going to edit the color of that. I'm going to make it pink. Cause pink's awesome, right? Okay, I'm gonna scroll in a little bit, and I'm gonna put the pink on the dark spots. And then on the lighter shades, I'm gonna put it up about right there. Get a little different shade of pink a 
about like that. And then now when I go into background, this is what it's going to look like. When you find the block, it's going to be like this. So now I'm going to merge it down, <clears throat> and so now we're finished. So now I go to File, Save As, I'm going to save it to my desktop, uh, U, to Pink, or I'm going to save it in a folder. So U, to Mod. And you make sure it saves as a PNG file. So I'm going to click Save. Save. Okay. Okay. Now, exit that out. Exit that out. <coughs> oh, excuse me. <coughs> okay. So now that, um, <coughs> geez. So now that you have um, <coughs> your OR finished, you want to go back to the program and you want to make sure multiple textures is uh, clicked. <coughs> and. Uh, all of these, you're going to want to put that into all of them, so click left, and then find desktop, uh, YouTube mod, YouTube pink ore, and you can see, I think it actually resizes it itself because, you know, it says input 16 by 16, output 16 by 16, I'm pretty sure it's going to resize it itself, um, <coughs> I think I could, I don't have, no, I'm not going to test that, so, yeah, um, it says it, all image files, so I think it supports all these. I'm just used to it supporting PNGs, so I don't know exactly. Uh, so you're going to click open, and now it's going to be right there, and you want to put it for all of these. So I'm going to go here, here, boom, boom, boom. Okay, so now I have it all like that. Alright, so now you're finished pretty much. Um, so now if you go to the left and you click that, now you'll see the YouTube or icon. So I'm just going to cancel all their exit, all those, and let's see. Test mod. I'm going to click the little play icon, and I'm going to get this console up. <clears throat> okay, so now it's going to start compiling it. Put it right there. And it's starting compiling. Or not, never mind. That was up more. Okay. Air. I don't know what that is. But all I know is it's saying compiling, so we'll wait a little bit. And I will pause the video and I will be back when it's finished. Okay, guys, I am back. And. Um. Whoa, okay. I thought it wasn't recording for a second. Um, okay, so I am went on to the how to go on to the older version now, well the 1.4.6 version instead, um, because I think it was a bug. I was sitting there for like 10 minutes trying to figure it out. It just wouldn't export it right and stuff. Um, it wouldn't install the mod onto the uh, Minecraft. Um, so I just decided just to go on this one because I know it best and I know it works. Um, there's just a little less features, um, so what we're going to do is we're going to go to install mod, YouTube mod, so it's going to recompile, yeah, for some reason it kept saying skipping recompiling, and I didn't know why it wouldn't recompile for some reason, it just kept saying skipping, so it's, but it's a pre-release, so obviously it's going to be some bugs, alright, <clears throat> just got to wait for this to go. I got all my settings good. Oh, here it goes, I think. I think I got all the settings here. Oh, I didn't put world generator. Five. Twenty percent. Twenty-eight. Oh, geez, I don't know if it... Let's try it again. Alright, let's just... Oh yeah, we just gotta go to test client, that's right. I think it's a bug on this also. Let's try this. Yeah, exporting textures YouTube mod. Alright, it should work now. After what the Um Cancel. Recompile error. Okay, what is going on with this? Let's 
try it again. This is a huge fail. <laughs> okay, there it goes. Oh, fatal error. Come on, just start the dang client. Check for errors. No errors found. Test client. YouTube mod, come on. There it goes. Oh my gosh. I will be back when I can figure this out. Okay guys, I am back and it just like, I didn't even click anything, it just actually loaded it on its own. So, anyways, so we are back and as you can see, if I go to my mods list, it shows YouTube and I could put this crap on here, whatever. Um, Mod editor, YouTube mod, ooh, da, da, da. generated by Deathly's mod editor, so it'll say all that stuff. You could have your URL and everything like that. So it is a free program, so obviously it's going to have some stuff to advertise it, but it doesn't really matter. I mean, who cares? Um, so I'm going to create a new world. Let's delete this one. Okay, create a new world. Let's click create. Man, this tutorial has been longer than I expected. Hopefully the next one will be better. <laughs> okay, come on. Anytime now. Alright. And Bandicam is going to lag this thing like crazy because it's compressing, which I don't like about Bandicam. It compresses while it records. Actually, it's not that bad right now. It's getting some lag now. I don't like Bandicam at all, but... Okay, but since I only have Windows XP, which hopefully I'm actually going to get Windows 8, probably. So, yeah. But that will be for, like, my birthday and stuff. So, if we go down to building blocks, we can see here's the YouTube board. And you can see, I can, if you can see the texture of it, I can place it. Oh, that's, what the heck. It's kind of weird. Let's try set night okay I don't know what it, it's like dark but time set zero I don't know why it's so dark but hopefully yours guys is, isn't depending on it might have been a setting I put but yeah guys so this has been the tutorial for or tutorial one of the deathly Deathly's Mod Editor. I almost forgot what it's called. And so yeah guys, so stay tuned for tutorial number two and we will be making it so it turns this into ingot ingots. I just failed again. Yeah, so bye.